What's up everybody? My name is Jeremy Jones and I am back with another video. Today we're talking a New Balance 650 Rain Cloud. So stay tuned. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I started my own life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating not scrolling. Mom and dad still support Alright, man, I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I made content about sneakers. All right, so let's dive into today's video. That's right, we're talking a New Balance 650 Rain Cloud. All right, man, we're gonna be keeping things very simple over today. We're gonna be answering a basic old question. Are they drip or skip? Let's just keep it there. All right, so first things first, these are set to release February 7th to the best of my knowledge, coming in at a retail price of $140, right? Okay, and of course, you know the kid glanced at the resale price. Now, I couldn't find the exact colorway, so to speak, but I found pretty much anything right in the ballpark. So I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say they're gonna average right at the same at the retail price at $150 and up on the resale market, you know, depending on the size, of course. Now, I wanted to touch on New Balances because I feel like personally, I don't give them enough love in this channel. And I, and if you guys haven't like followed me on the, or signed up for the sold out Discord, check it out because we definitely be having like, you know, on feet picks in there. But if you haven't caught on, New Balances is something I definitely use for the gym is what I was about to get at right there. Now these, right, this is supposed to be the high top version to the best of my knowledge. The 650R is the technical name, right? And I don't know what it is. And me and Dunks was talking about this offline as well, right? With New Balances and their names of their sneakers with all these different numbers. Now from what I got, the higher the number is supposed to be, the better the quality, but don't quote me on that. Again, I'm kind of new to the New Balance world as far as what the, all the information is for as far as like what everything stands for, right? Okay, now I will say this. Performance-wise, New Balance goes above and beyond from what I'm getting, right, okay? So what I was about to say is pretty much the 550 is supposed to be the low top version and then the 650, this is the high top version, right, okay? I don't know, but that, that's, that's what I'm getting from this. Now, we've seen like where there have been collabs you know, and I think um, one of the bigger name brands that's been on there, when it's a collab with the New Balance, it seems to do well. And I don't think this one is an official collab. They're just calling this one the Rain Cloud. I think aluminum is the colorway that it's aiming to. So it's kind of got that cloudy look to it. So if you're into New Balances, this is something that maybe you can get me caught up to speed and even probably sign up for the Discord and get us all caught up to speed with it if you're looking for that comfort shoe. I think, right, these are also known, and I want to say the 650, they were known to be like a basketball shoe, but don't quote me because if you actually look and read up on the New Balance website, they say it's an all purpose shoe. So to me, that means you pretty much can do anything in it, right? Okay, so I'm guessing it's got that just durability, so to speak. But overall, I did want to touch on these. Not a bad shoe, but definitely something, again, I wouldn't write home about, but I did want to touch on it and bring it to the channel for the people who are New Balance heads out there because I know in certain areas, that's all they rock is New Balances. So this, this shoe isn't bad, I will say that. It's just something that I know if I'm gonna go into the New Balance world, I don't know if I would start with this one. So for me personally, these will be a skip, but not a bad shoe. Nothing home, nothing I would write home about, but just something I know I don't wanna add to the collection, but definitely worth talking about if that makes sense. But overall, these will be a skip for the kid, but I wanna know what you guys think down in the comment section and will you be going after these on February 7th, retail them at $140. And of course, let me know if you think they're drip, or skip. All right, man, I'm gonna go ahead and get up out of this thing and stop rambling, man. Y'all be sure to hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you're new, consider subscribing. I made content about sneakers. Again, my name is Jeremy Jones, and thank you for watching, and I'm out. I